I found it to be a careful and don't tell people what they're doing because you might say it to the wrong person. A scene from A Very British Gangster, a film directed by Donald McIntyre about the life of a notorious criminal Dominic Noonan, the latest of a myriad of films inspired by gangsters and the criminal underworld. Throughout history we've seen um, the criminal element uh, documented in films, in mm. theatre, in art. What do you think our fascination is with that? Well, I think on a very fundamental raw level is that they are the rule breakers. And I think we all kind of, uh, you know, adhere to a set of codes and we have our speeding fines and we have our parking tickets, but these guys, you know, operate outside the law. I think it's part of the fascination. A Very British Gangster is released in December, but currently on show at the Café Gallery in Southwark is Goldfinger, an exhibition by artist Faisal Abdu Allah featuring 11 gold portraits of some of London's so-called criminal elite, including Howard Marks and the recently deceased Joey Pyle. Four and a half years I've been kind of in conversation with them. Um, I was helped by Mitch Pyle who gave me the kind of doorway to meet his father, Joey Pyle. And a series of meetings, a um, series of kind of uh, going to clubs, going to certain venues to try and gain their honour and their respect. As one of the subjects of the show, along with other members of his family, Mitch Pyle denies the fact that the exhibition may glorify criminality. It's basically like to say, for you to judge us and what you think. I mean, are we good people? Are we bad people? We just do what we do. Do you ever kill a man? It's been a list. I have. Shot it's a great on. subject matter uh, 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 for reporting, it's a great subject matter for art. Interestingly enough, the underworld has been completely excluded as a subject area, you know, for art. My only duty as an artist is to create the conditions for people to be critical. And um, I feel I have kind of full range to um, investigate what I find interesting or taxing or disturbing. And then the public then have, you know, have their own choice. Goldfinger runs at the Café Gallery until the 4th of November. Brandery Manus, BBC London News.